Hey guys, it's Melissa and today I'm gonna show you how to get this starry, glittery, purple smoky eye. So to start off like I always do, I'm priming my eyes with Wet n Wild concealer and I'm just putting that all over my eyelids and then I'm gonna blend it out with a sponge. Then I just go in and set that with really any setting powder. After that, I'm going into my Certified Tropical Wonders palette and I'm taking the shade Firefish, which is the lightest purple shade, and I'm just going to be putting that into my crease and a little bit above my crease and this is working as a transition shade for the darker purple colors after that i'm going back into the Tropical Wonders palette and I'm taking the medium purple shade and putting that into my crease, blending it into the transition color. I hear that purples are really hard to make in palettes, so these are kind of hard to work with to be honest. Um. I mean, they're pretty good. The only one that I have sort of a problem with is the dark purple shade, which I'll talk about when I get to it. But with this shade, we were just building it up. And now I'm taking the darkest purple shade. I have to take this on like a more flat brush. I can't use it with a blending brush. It literally just blends completely out if you use it with a blending brush. But with this brush, it worked perfectly. But I'm just putting this in my crease in my outer corner. I really wanted to create some depth in my crease. So I'm just going to build that up until I have it as dark as I want. Then I'm going in with this purple, well, light purple, um... Shimmer Shadow from Kristen Lee Cosmetics. This is in the shade Infatuated. And I'm just putting that on my lid. I sprayed this with um, water before I did this. Okay, now I'm taking the Certified Glitter Adhesive and Certified Silver Glitter. And this is where I'm going to be drawing over above my crease just a line i did this in sections i didn't do it all like at once i didn't draw a line with the glue at all at once i did it in sections so i did the outer section first and i just drew a line with the glue and then went in and took some glitter and patted that on where i drew the glue And as you can see, I took it in. And obviously you're gonna have some glitter fallout, so just go in with a brush and just flick it away. And you should be good. I went back in with that shimmer shadow. I actually took a darker one too. I'll put it on the screen what it's called because I don't remember what it's called. But um, I just went over that other shimmer shadow a little bit with a darker shade. This is where I added the stars. Literally all I did was put a tiny dot of glue and took these confetti stars, put them where I wanted them, and look how cute it freaking looked. Then I also decided I was going to line my lash line with eyeliner. Don't know why I decided to do this, but I did it. Then for my lower lash line, I'm basically just repeating what I did on the top. So I took 
and but instead of taking the lightest shade i took the medium shade first and i just put that on my lower lash line and then you'll see me go into the um darker shade and you know just do the same thing Now I'm going into a dark shade. I used a smaller brush for this so I could get closer to my lower lash line. Then, just like I did on the top, I'm just drawing a line with glue where I want the glitter. And then I'm just going to go over it with gl the glitter. Super easy. I ended up deciding that I wanted to do all below my lower lash line which like I wasn't going to do at first I was just gonna keep it <laughs> just the inner corner but it looked kind of weird to me so I just decided to do my whole lower lash line then doing the same thing as the top drawing a dot for the stars and adding my stars Now here I'm just, I did my whole face already, but I decided I wanted to tell you what highlighter I was wearing. This is a purple highlighter. It's called Passionista from Kristen Lee Cosmetics. I have a code with Kristen Lee Cosmetics. It's eclectic. She's literally my favorite person in the entire world. I love her and her products are amazing. And that's it. This is the finished look. That's it. I added some lashes. I also lined my, um waterline with black like I always do but that's nothing special <laughs> that's it for this video I hope you enjoy please give it a thumbs up and subscribe and I'll see you guys next time with a new video bye